Major Henry and March in the best day of all. The first day of May. On the first day of May, Henry woke up early and said to his big dog, Mush, I'm having a birthday today. Mush wagged his tail, rolled over, and snored. Mush said, Henry, wake up. I'm having a birthday today. Mush wagged and ro rolled over to the other side and snored some more. Mush said, Henry, birthday cake. Mush opened one eye. Ice cream said Henry. Mush opened the other eye. And lots of lots of crackers said Henry. Mush jumped up. He shook Henry's head. Mush was having a birthday and Mush would be having crackers. The first day of May looked pretty good. A colorful morning balloons were all over Henry's house. Pink ones, orange ones, green ones, yellow ones. They were in the bathroom, they were in the kitchen, they were in the living room, and the porch was full of them. That light balloon, said Henry, so much. Much like the yellow one, and lagged. Henry's father came into the house. He was ca carrying a camera. Pictures, said Henry's father. Oh no, Henry whispered too much. That like pictures too. Henry's father took a lot of pictures. He took one of Henry, he took one of Mush, he took one of Henry and Mush. He took one of Henry and Mush and Henry's mother in the bookcase took one of all four of them. After the pictures, Henry's mother fixed Henry's favorite breakfast, pancake with strawberries. The family ate and ate and ate. When they were done, they had four sticky red mouths. The first day of May was looking even better. Crackers from the sky. Henry invited his friends for a party. Then they came three o'clock. As everyone was shy, no one knew what to do when Henry's father said, everybody outside. <coughs> In the backyard, Henry's mother and Henry's father had first games. They were ring toss, they would go fishing, they were potato sack races. And hanging from a tree <coughs> was a big blue panita shaped like a donkey. The winners in ring toss got Dr. Dr. Wings. The win winners at go fishing got baby goldfish. The winners at potato sack races got bags of potato chips. Finally, it was time for the pirata. Henry's father tied a cloth over Henry's head. He put a stick in Henry's hand. He whispered a message in Henry's ear. When Henry started to play, one and we shouted two, three. Mask was lagging hard. Whoa, on the fourth screen, the piano cracked open. Out fell stuckers and bubblegum and taffy and hundreds of little crackers. Everyone was happy and laughed most of all. He never knew what crackers would come, the, come from the sky. Best day. After the game, Henry Paris brought out a big bowl of cherry nut ice cream and a very white birthday cake. The cake looked like Henry's fish tank. It had blue water colored rocks and strip and spotted fish. Much sniff and sniff. Maybe it looked like water, but it smelled like cake. After the fish time, cake was eaten up. It was time to open presents. Red balls, purple paper, big cards, everything went flying in the air. Henry got an airplane model, a robot, and a stuffed snow leopard, and a basketball. He also got a box of soft trees. Those must be for you, Henry Hope much.
When the party was over, everyone went home. They all had lots of taffy and bubble gum and stubborn and baby fish and potato chips. They were all full of cake and ice cream. Some of them were full of crackers. Henry and Henry's parents and Henry's big dumb boys sat quietly in the backyard and closed their eyes. They listened to the boys say rest. And each dreamed of a birthday wishes on the best day of all. I read you in your lunch on the best day of all. I'm going to read you another book next time. Bye!